hello and welcome to my Yelp haul. So, uh, I'm gonna perhaps remember to actually do the timestamps. We'll see. Um, but I'm gonna try to do it uh, in the order of uh, how they got signed. <laughs> uh, so I'll put a little picture up uh, of myself and the said author and uh, the, I'll show you the books. Yeep. Um, yeah. Sara El Arifi. <laughs> um, so I brought both of these from home. Fancy editions. And um, you can see she signed them. Um, I want to say it says Heart of a Duster. I'm not too sure. I, I have, I'm very bad at reading people's handwriting, I'm not going to lie. Uh, and then that was the final strife. And then we have the battle drum. Let's see. All right. Um, and this was already signed, so what she did was just write my name and the little thingy which says uh, Ready you will be No, you're not ready for what's happening in these books No, you're not <laughs> uh, Honestly, I read both of these before go going It's such a good series. I cannot wait for book number three whenever that will be, next year sometime, I'm, I'm assuming, and uh, yeah, I have a vlog for it, I will link it down below. June Dawson, so Her Majesty's Royal Coven and the Shadow Cabinet, uh, both of which I brought from home, uh, the Shadow Cabinet was already signed, um, And this one says, welcome to HMRC, so Her Majesty's Royal Coven. Also, she did like, um, the, oh, the thingies in the O's. <laughs> wow, my brain is flooded. I don't know what. Uh, so this was already signed it, signed it, signed. Um... So she only put like my name and uh, a little text, which I think it says, sorry about R.I.P. I can't read handwriting. <laughs> um, I just said a spoiler, didn't I? Oops. Anyway. So excited for the next like installment. So apparently we're not getting book three next year. We're getting book zero. So a prequel to like how it all got started or something. I didn't hear the talk, so I don't know all the specifics. I just heard things. <laughs> um, anyway, very excited about that, but it means waiting another year for book three. And this had me in a chokehold and I want book three. <laughs> I do have a vlog, link down below. Kate Dillon, oh yeah. So this one I brought from home, Mind Walker, uh, and I did, I have read it. Um, a vlog will be coming when I've read book number two. Um, little sign also she had like um the stampy things anyway it says do not surrender control yeah mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and this one mind breaker Do do do. it says capitalism worships at the altar of crime <sighs> And for those, I also got two all prints. So I'm trying to see if, yeah. And this one. Stunning, stunning. So like I said, I haven't read this one 
as I'm filming this video, but I will be very soon because um, the way this ended, I was sure it's gonna be uh, like a standalone. I'm like, what is happening? Um, but we have a book two. I knew we had a book two. That's why I was so confused by book one. Um, <laughs> but very excited. It's also also kind of short, so <sighs> so excited. Anyway, also these these covers, I love them. B. Fitzgerald. I only had this book. So, Girl, Goddess and Queen and with the fancy little spread edges to hell with love. I also read this before going and, uh, ooh, a little uh, calling card. Um, let's see. Where is this one? Do -do -do. It says, bring some chaos. Because if you know, you know. You know, you know. Uh, this is a Greek myth retelling. I have a trouble saying that myth retelling <laughs> combination of words. Um, so good. Highly recommend. Also, video will be linked. Yes. Did I do a vlog for it or did I just do a recent reads one? I don't remember. But one of those. I know there's a video. We have some uh, Jonathan Stroud books. So, out of all the queues I stood in, this was by far the most difficult to stand in because, um, so, uh, Jonathan Stroud likes to talk. Fair enough. I mean, I, I would be too if I'd written a lot of books and were proud of them. Um, the trouble is, uh, so did everyone else that stood in line. So basically, everyone that came up to him stood there for like 10 minutes just talking to him. And um, yeah, I I, <laughs> I think I stood in his line for like an hour and a half, at least. And it was difficult. I was exhausted. My back hurt. I needed desperately to drink and eat and all that. So I was a bit faint. I'm not going to lie. Uh, but I did finally <laughs> end up coming all the way. So the first book is The Amulet of Samarkand. Sam I don't know how to say things. Anyway, um, where did he sign it? Free! Um, so it says, um, I'm not sure, very something wishes, it's, it looks like it says like, her, <laughs> I don't know, uh, anyway, it's signed and it's also dated, so that's fun, um, then we have book number two, who, the golem's eye, um, great to meet you, love that. Yeah. And the last one, Ptolemy's Gate. I still really want to say the P, but I've learned it's not. I did learn that a long time ago. But I did when I when I read these books, which was years ago, I did say Ptolemy. <laughs> anyway, uh this one just says Happy Reading. I'm so excited. I really want to get like the new new covers because um the like prequel so there's a prequel book as well and um that one is in new covers it's not in the old one but he did say <laughs> apparently we'll be getting new covers next year so i'm like so many new covers um yeah <laughs> i do kind of want to get them and reread them because it was a very long time ago and um i was fairly new to the whole fantasy game when I read these, so I did find them slightly difficult, um, but they aren't that difficult to read. Um, but yeah. This one I got new, um, so it is already signed by the author. It is um, The Cats We Meet Along the Way by Nadia Mikhail, and um, she was so sweet, honestly. Uh, so it was already signed, um, 
<laughs> she, she, she looked at it and was like, did I write this? Um, yeah, I'm, I'm assuming it was her. Um, anyway, she wrote, I hope you enjoyed the book. Thank you for reading. It was lovely to meet you. So, she did write a little. She was so sweet, honestly, so sweet. I haven't read this yet, so I will be reading it sometime soon, I hope. Kika Hatsupulu Apollo. I'm so sorry. Um, I have read this. Such a good read. Also, ended on a damn cliffhanger, and I'm like, yeah, and next book, please, next book. <laughs> um, anyway, she wrote Weave Your Own Fate and Gold Writing. I love that. That's so cute. <laughs> Why? It also kind of says, looks like she just signed it JK. I, d I don't think she actually did that, but... And also for that book, um, there was some, uh, some silly, silly, some swag uh, from said book. So this is, I think it's the, um, the cover, <laughs> the cover of book number two, which... Uh, I think it's called Hearts That Cut, at least that's what it says on the back. And we also got this. Um, there we go. A bunch of people. Please don't make me name them because I'm sure I'll be wrong, but I'm pretty sure that's the main character. <laughs> I'm, I'm so good at this, aren't I? So good! Kayleen Bayron. So, we'll start from the bottom. So, Cinderella is a dead. All of these I brought from home as well. I have read them and in different occasions. She just uh, signed my name, wrote my name, and little signature. Um, the Poison Heart. Also. And this, the sequel, yeah, the sequel, uh, this Wicked Fate. I'm sorry I can't stand still because, I don't know, but, yeah. Boop. And also the last one I have, You're Not Supposed to Die Tonight, which is in, uh, I think, the last Yalk read, pre-Yalk read. Um, well, yeah, signed. Signed, sealed, delivered. So many, so many people in the Kaylon, Kaylon, Kaylin Bayron line had loads of like different books. I know she's written, um, I think it's middle grade and such. Um, she's written loads of diff other books than these, but um, they also had like books that I don't think had come out yet. And I'm like, where did you get these? A book I have read before I went, but I don't think that video is out yet. I'm pretty sure it's not out yet. It's uh, The Very Secret Society of Irregular Witches by Sangu Mandana. Yeah, probably. <laughs> uh, we had a funny little chat <laughs> about... So, I don't think a lot of people had this cover. Uh, and so she said, oh, you have this cover. And I'm like, yeah, I did want to get the others. Because <laughs> um, I think this is the US cover. And the other ones, the UK ones, the paperback and the hardback, they are the same, but with a slight twist to them. So, it's... Two different ones, I want to say. And I was like, I, I wanted them both, but next time. <laughs> um, also, very nice book. I love this book. It was so cute. I did want more of it. Um, she drew a little witchy hat. <laughs> so cute. Let's do the Holly Jackson ones. So... Um, I brought all of these, so this last one, the top one, did arrive just like the day before I left. Um, it is also the only one I got signed, so... The popularity of Holly Jackson. Whew. So, um... 
loads of people had loads of books i mean i did have lots of books too and holly jackson was there signing for hours so many more hours than initially intended um which was i mean so nice of her and i know a lot of people complained because by the end of it uh you were only allowed to get one book signed and <laughs> a lot of people complained about that and i was like you know what i'm just gonna have to go meet her again it's not the end of the world uh i'm sure she's gonna do lots more signings i'm sure she'll probably come to Yalk more times as well. So, um, the only one I actually got signed uh, was this one, the special, new special edition of A Good Girl's Guide to Murder. I did this one because it felt more special. So, very quickly, to Shelley, or oh, Holly Jackson. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna have to like track Holly Jackson down and get these signs, signs <laughs> signed, because um, it is, um it's a favorite series and i'm not gonna lie also i have pre-ordered book two and three in this series and this uh uh edition um so there's that yeah that that is i mean can you blame me can you blame me it also has that little uh ribbon bookmark thing can you blame me if you do what is wrong with you i'm joking <laughs> A bunch of books I haven't read. Yay! <laughs> um, so, we'll start with uh, Priory of the Orange Tree, shall we? And I'm gonna have to do this again. Yeah, we'll start with Priory of the Orange Tree, the chunky chunky book. Um, so, very simply, just my name and her signature. But I'm very happy to have that. And then A Day of Fallen Night, which, which, which I did, didn't it have a sticker on it? Um, I did have this pre-signed. Um, so I have her name over here. Um, yeah, it says signed by the author. And uh, she did sign it again. <laughs> Doubly signed. Uh, she was so lovely, by the way. I mean, all the authors were very lovely, but yeah. Um, let's do the, let's do the, I don't know which order these are in, so I'm just going to do one after the other, because, um, I don't know. Uh, the Song Rising, also, just my name and her name. I'm gonna have to figure out which order they go in because I have a feeling I'm gonna read them in the wrong order if I don't. Wee! I know Bone Season is the the first one, which is this one here. Badoo! <laughs> yeah! And the Mime Order. Woo! <laughs> Why am I doing these noises? And also, so um, the whole Bone Season... There's four books currently, but there are more coming. So all of them, the rest of the, the three books that aren't Bone Season, that's out, um, are coming out in like matching covers of this. Um, so yeah, I didn't get the special Yalk <laughs> um, sprayed edges, which I'm, I'm a little bit sad about, but also I can justify buying that book again when I already did have this one. I'm good with this. Um, but anyway, so this is apparently revised and rewritten slightly. It's revised anyway uh, by Samantha um, to make it, I don't know, better. <laughs> um, I haven't read any of her books yet. I've started The Priory, um, but I haven't like continued it. So um, I'm, I think I'm going to read like the paperbacks before. I even picked this one up, um, so I do the the original versus the revised ones. Anyway, so this one is also signed, but with red, with a red pen. What is this accent now? Anyway. Hollyborn! <laughs> um, I love Hollyborn. I bloomin' love her. So... 
all the books I have here are all her books apart from three which I already did have signed in 2018 and uh, her latest adult book which I think is called Girlfriends so or We Were Friends or something like that it has two different titles and two different uh, uh, covers it's uh, it's not confusing at all anyway the books I have by her uh, dot 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 and Happy New Year this is um, the like novella collection of uh, the spinster series i think it's called spinster yeah spinster club special um yeah we i'm gonna do those sounds a lot aren't i also this book pretending it starts like this i hate men Do you need more of an incentive to read the book? No, you don't. Um, we have What's a Girl Gotta Do? This is, um, is it book two of the Spencers? Book two, I think. Book two or three? I don't remember. But yeah. Mm. And am I normal yet? I'm never normal, so that's... That's going to be a no. <laughs> wee, 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 wee. And some more. The yearbook. I read this just before going. Oh, the one before that is the manifesto and how to be interesting. And uh, this is the places I cried in public. Um, I did tell her uh, that. Uh, what happens in this book actually happened to a friend of mine and I didn't know how to tell my friend so I gave them this book yeah yeah that that was my way of helping without <laughs> saying the words because I just did not know the words to say um and then yeah <laughs> and this book is how hard can a love it be which is this one. It's one of the Spinster books. It's been signed. I'm, I'm loving my face, facial expression. What magic is this? Mine! <laughs> and her very first book, I believe. Soulmates. Woo! This book is so different from like all the rest of her books. Um, <laughs> I mean, it's, it has similar themes, but the way it's written um, is, uh, it, it's funny. I did like it a lot, though. So the only one I didn't bring from home was this one, which I bought new. So I haven't read it yet. So it's, you could be so pretty. Or if we do this, you should be so angry. I love, um, I love that. It's so much fun. Okay, so this one. Just sign to me. That's a lot of Holly Bomb books with only one, <laughs> one to read. Now for the arcs I got. So I did give some away because I just did not have room. Um, so I only have three. So this one, The Love Interest by Helen uh, Comerford. Um, she was there, so she signed it. Yay! I love that. I have no idea what it's about, but it comes out in June 2024. So watch me try to read that before it comes out. This one comes out in February 2024, so that's it's a lot shorter though. It's your presence is required at the Royal Court of Gala. Gala? Gala. It's called Goddess Crown by Shade La La Petite. The bleep, bleep, bleep. Um, yeah. Oh, that's probably what the cover is gonna be. Ooh. And then the last one I have, um, Galloway Girls, Lily's Just Fine by Jill Stewart. <laughs> 
Uncorrected proof coffee not for sale or quotation. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Those were the arcs I got. And now for some non Yalk books I got just because the hell of it. Yeah. So I got Christina Lawrence uh, Inner Holidays. Holidays. Um, because I've been wanting to read this for a while. I did also kind of want the green cover. So uh, there's a green cover and there's a blue cover, which I ha have in my hand obviously um <laughs> uh, and i've been looking at them, which one do i have which one do i get um well this one's in store it was uh, a two buy one get one half price yeah that's the one buy one get one half price so i picked this one up i also picked up um the christmas wish the paperback version by lindsay kelk um, I do have the hardback, so do I need this? Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Don't judge me. I'm gonna, I'm gonna read this again because I loved it. I, I loved Lindsay Kelp though. Um, and another Lindsay Kelp book was Love Me Do, which I think is the one that came out this year. Possibly. It, it, it's the latest one. <laughs> You can see I'm keeping track of all the books that's coming out, obviously. But it is Lindsay Kelk. I love Lindsay Kelk. I read Lindsay Kelk's book. Um, so, obviously, when I was in store, I got it. All of these were buy one, get one half price. Yes, there are three. Um, I did get another one, which I gave to my mum. So, I'm not going to show you. <laughs> that was all the books. Yeah. And now I need to organize them somehow. Behind me, I've sort of started, but also not. Uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Um, this was basically just me bragging about meeting authors and getting books signed. Yeah, I don't care. <laughs> anyway, um, until next time, until then, take care, bye-bye.